Hello everyone, I'm Alex Bavolsik from HowToDoTech.com and today we're going to be looking at chat heads on Android. Now you've probably heard about chat heads, they come out free with the next Facebook Messenger update. They look really cool and if you can't get Facebook home on your device, they're the closest thing you'll get to it that um, you can have without installing all of Facebook home. But you might be wondering, how do I get chat heads? You know, they haven't shown up by default and um, I really like to use them and I just don't know how. It's actually really simple you've probably just overlooked it. So if you open up Messenger um, you'll notice that I blurred out all of these names except for this one, Computing Forever. Um, I'm going to be supporting them and I don't really think they're going to be worried um, about their name getting out considering they are a public YouTube channel. So um, if I wanted to pop out the chat head for them all I have to do is hold my finger down and then this message will pop up and I can hit pop out chat head. Now from here, the chat head with their logo will be out and I can play around with it and then if anyone else gives me a message that I want to put into a chat head, it will pop up right on the screen right there. Um, so when I tap on it, the message that I sent to them shows up and if I had multiple chat heads, they would also show up. So maybe I um, open this back up and I went down and I wanted to put out Chow Super Taster, another YouTube channel that I'm going to be supporting. If I hold my finger on there and hit pop out chat head, now I have two. So when I tap on it, both of them show up in the top left. And um, I can pick whichever one I want to be viewing. And um, the one on top will be shown on the home screen, or the one that's been added latest. And then I can always hit this Facebook Messenger button at the top to go back to the Facebook Messenger. Now if you rearrange them to put, say, uh, Computing Forever on the right, it will be shown on top rather than something else. And you can also see, I think it's really cool when you move it, you see all the different chat heads show up um, while you're moving them. And then if you, say, move it to a different part of the screen, it won't stay in the middle. It'll actually move to the edge. It's really, really nice because um, organization is so much easier if I just say, you know, I want to tap something in the left, so I'll just push it to the right, I'll just push it to the left, and it doesn't get stuck somewhere stupid on the screen. It goes to a corner or to an edge, like I could put in that top corner, put it in the bottom corner, and if I ever want to get rid of a chat head, I can get rid of all of them by just holding and throwing them down to the X, or I could get rid of a single one, say Chow Super Taster, by holding it and moving it down to the X, and then I only have one chat head left. Now the last thing you're going to want to look at to get the most out of your chat heads is going down to the settings and um, tapping those. And then from here you'll want to go to SMS set slash MMS. And then you can choose to enable text messaging. So if you want to replace the Messenger app on your Android device, which a lot of people have problems with, um, just they don't like the design of it, it's nothing screwed up, whether you're using Verizon, Sprint, or whatever. Your text messages are all sent the same, just the UI is different because it's tied into chat heads. And by enabling this checkbox, you'll be um, using this as your tech, you can text using this. And then if you tap the box below it, you can use it as your main texting app. So if you um, have a link to a text or something along those lines, and you just want to open up text by default, this will be the app that does that rather than your messenger app and again these settings are easily changeable just by hitting checkboxes so we really hope you have enjoyed this video if you have any questions please leave them down in a comment below or email us at howtodotechyt at gmail.com don't forget to like this video subscribe to the channel for more videos like this one and email us if you have any suggestions for future videos so now there are four different topics that you can click on to go to different videos from our channel, I am Alex Bavolsik, and I will see you next time.